Hello guys, so I'm gonna trim or take out all this elephant bush. The other one, this one. I'm gonna throw them. Uh, they're not healthy and I think they are. I want my, this one, the Dracaena. Is this one type of Dracaena to grow better? So I might uh, take out from the soil, take out the soil. And then uh, I have two of these pots anyway. We cannot see the beauty of the pots. So it's time to, to trim them. Let me trim first. And then they're not healthy anyways. Uh, look at, look. trim 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 and then I think the soul needs to be <laughs> poor elephant bush because I wanna clean this patio I don't want bugs. Michael is coming soon and then we can, he can, uh, before I don't have many bugs, I don't have any bugs. <laughs> but I was not learned, I, I was not taught how to, you need to do a formulation on that. Uh, see, now I can see. Because I want this to grow, this one. I think it, uh, this elephant bush limit. That's why it doesn't grow much better. So it's so dirty here. I'm cleaning, I'm cleaning. <laughs> okay, the other one is here. Hold on, guys. I'm using see I took out already and you can see the beauty of the pots okay guys so now we're here on the coleus and then I'm, I just gave them water see the soil is wet with vitamins uh, with fertilizer the just the miracle grow so what I'm gonna do is to spray neem oil because if I didn't catch them uh, I think a week, oh no, two weeks ago, bugs are starting, the mealy bugs. So I immediately spray neem oil. And then uh, since it's uh, noon, uh, what time is it now? I think it's one o'clock. So it's already, the sun is not here anymore. So I'm just gonna spray now. And it's cooler. And I have the electric pan, so I'm not worried that uh, he gonna, she get, they gonna get burned because, like I said, there's no. Uh, the sun is already. I mean, it's still bright here, but the sun is already heading in front. And then I have an electric pan, and then there is a shade, shade there, and then that's it. So I, I barely uh, pinched them maybe soon so now they smells good because of the neem oil so it's so clean now all right yay all right we'll go more okay guys so i'm done uh putting the tradescanti i look at that so beautiful <laughs> i build it up and then let me push it there and then the other one i'm still sweeping here the other one, so I have these two more of this, uh, this, uh, how you call this, Dracaena. So I just repot it here, the two, one and two. Earlier it's just two. And then I'm gonna put as well the Tradescantia here. I'm gonna see this part again because I'm gonna hang over there. The I took out 
Uh, what is that? Uh, I forgot. <laughs> I took out two of the hanging plants. String of banana. Because I treated that string of banana. I check. I treated. Uh, early detection is so good. Once you do detect that uh, mealybugs is starting. So treat it with... Uh, I usually treat with neem oil and at the same time catching those uh, those bugs with uh, with my uh, alcohol. So now we're heading here. Here. So this is the Mayana now. They're clean. They're clean already. <laughs> Are you guys clean? <laughs> yes. Okay, let's twist like this. Okay, there you go. At least they, they tried <laughs> rather than dying. Okay, there you go. Okay, so now this area, I utilize this as my, you know, I put the the one that uh, uh, trying to try. Not all are thriving, but I, I just checked. They're all good now. And this one is looks good. And more over there. More over there. The sad news is my variegated elephant bush. Look, they look sad. They they are not. They don't look healthy to me. See, I don't know what's wrong. I need to check. So, but not now because I wanna just clean. This is a big project. I do believe. I need to check the roots, what's going on. But my, uh, or maybe they, I, I need to study about the variegated one because uh, maybe they don't like too much salt, uh, too much salt. Maybe they don't like too much water or too much uh, sunlight. Let's see this one too. So uh, we, we'll, we're gonna, I'm gonna do my best to to check. Leaves are falling apart. See, see. I don't know what's wrong. See, they just fall apart. So I need to to propagate this, or I don't know. Even the propagation, I think, is too hard because they are variegated. That's the sad part of variegated. Okay, let's do here. So. This one, I need to clean it. This one, I don't know what will happen here. I think I need to trim over there, but I'm not gonna do it today in this video. It's too much work, but uh, we're gonna do it. So I'll just sweep, and then I'm gonna put some of my pots here. Actually, they are here, but these kittens are keep coming here. So my plan is to trim this one the shed and then attach here and then uh, so th so I can sweep underneath all right so guys uh, I decided to trim take off the the shed here so I can sweep under so what I did is uh hold on let me bring you slowly hold on. so what I did is I pulled out this one and then I put the zip lock over here. I retouch it. That's why the Mayana or the Coleus is here. So I'm gonna put them back. There you go. So I, after this, I'm done and I'm gonna edit this, uh, this video. So once I off the camera, I'm just gonna sweep that floor and then put this uh, these two over here, arrange it here, and that one, <laughs> this one, put it back here, and then in the morning, if the sun is too intense, I pull this out like this. So the done, they're covered. So I, I have another <laughs> option 
that uh, this cactus uh, tail, monkey tail, I do believe, since they are cactus, they are the two hanging plants that I'm gonna put on here. Because this side is so hot, look, there's still the sun over there. And uh, I think the one that I put here before dried up, died. Because th that part, the la the se that, that <laughs> hook, the sun is uh, old, is there the whole day. So I'm gonna put instead of the instead of the burro's tail, which I don't want them to get burned and the and and here, <laughs> let me see. And this one, I think I'm just gonna put this one over there. All right, hey okay, guys. So it's almost clean here, so I can pull out. This uh, succulent's not good here on the summer. <laughs> they all either burn or getting sick. <laughs> I need to know what's going on with you guys. Okay. I'm not over here. It's hard, I'm holding the camera. <laughs> Then the rest of my, some of my propagated ones are, I put back in the greenhouse. I put back in the greenhouse, there you go. So the last one would be this one. All right guys, I think that's it for now and then see you tomorrow. For the finale, I'll just need to finish and if uh, the plants is not happy in one position, put them in another position. If not happy in another position, put them, you can switch them and you can uh, check what's going on. Okay guys, so this is for now and then I'll share to you tomorrow the outcome if, <laughs> if it's done completely. So far, this is, uh, we clean this, I clean, <laughs> it's clean, I clean, we clean. So, those are the propagated one, and underneath is clean. There you go, so clean, and this one too. Clean, 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 and, uh, okay. Gonna check on here. This one too. Let's see if they will thrive here. Because uh, they got dried. I think they need uh, indirect sun. So, sunlight. So that there is a shade here all the time. Because I took their, their position was here before. I gave it to potos. And they are so good over there. And I cannot take out the potos there. Because the potos looks good. So, also. And then one team, I want the, the, this color to be coordinated with the caligium below. I'm trying to hide the caligium <laughs> next time. <laughs> that, that, that side would be the, the next after giving you this one. So now, so this one, I need to put the... I need to, to cut more of the Trades and I'm gonna put there. Okay, everyone. <laughs> okay, let's continue this one. So I told earlier that I'm not gonna uh, video or film this one, the, the putting this, uh, these plants here. Like I said, the, the 
monkey cactus we're gonna hang here oh, the camera and then I'm gonna video tomorrow the outcome would be real <laughs> all right guys thank you so much everyone thank you thank you for tuning in again thank you for your support thank you for your uh, friendship and always remember God loves you Jonah loves you we love you and always passion makes a garden and a home beautiful thank you namaste